Yakum. I'm seeing a lot of dead people. They look like they were sauteing. Shit. Be careful. Jacob, I've reached the solar tower. I'm going in. What are you seeing in there? Some kind of weird electrical sparks flying everywhere. It means you're getting close. This altar, did I not mention? He's a goddamn electro freak. You mean he lights up light bulbs? More like flash frying everything for a mile. Look, I know you've always been able to handle yourself, but this son of a bitch is on a whole other level. As of recently, so am I.
And so, Outrider, you've had your first kill. We also do not die so easily, do we? Seth. Come. We must speak. They asked you to help them. To fight the altar down there. Why didn't you? The pathetic monstrosity was a distraction. People are dying because of him. Without the supply route open... They all die. These feeble creatures. Slaughtering each other over scraps. You waste your gifts. Running errands for them. Trying to win their meaningless, endless war. You must realize... You are not like them anymore. So what? I should play at being a god like you. I am not playing. But you are something even more. Altered and Outrider. Alas, Outrider. Do what you were sent here for. Go beyond the frontier. These people need their gods. Only one like you could lead them to a future. Why not you? They call him Moloch. I fight another war, far above this petty squalor. My war is with the worst of our kind. This one is too powerful. He will destroy us all, unless I hunt him down. But this is not your fight. You are to be the shepherd. Find a way for them out of this slaughter. Outrider. <laughs> sure, it's done. Your supply line's open, I'm heading home. Don't thank me yet. You still got a war to win. Not sure anyone's winning this goddamn war. But there's something even more important you might be able to do. Come see me in my bunker.
hear Captain Reiner's dead. Yeah. I find some stuff. Hey, man. Why can't we just get the I don't believe you. They do, Peck. Yeah, I uh, Sure. The signal in the forest. You remember it? Yeah. Like it was yesterday. You still have its frequency, don't you? You mean this frequency? Curve. You got the winning lotto numbers tattooed on your ass cheek, too? Still don't believe me? Ugh, I hate when you play the I told you so. That signal is still playing like a distant echo. It's digital, which means it must be coming from a place where there is no anomaly. The problem is, we've never been able to locate its source because we've never had the right frequency. Until you showed up. So now, listen close, you need to bring those precise numbers to Dr. Abraham Zahidi, one of our last scientists. Bullshit. He's been deep in enemy territory for weeks now. Five rations says Zahidi's dead. We don't know that. You... I've seen you before, it was... in the med lab. You woke me out of cryo. Guess life's real funny that way. Meet Jane. Sniper, first class. She almost died trying to save his life. She'll guide you. Wait, Shira. When we landed, that signal was already playing. Do you have any idea who or what is sending it? Do yourself a favor. Don't ask that question. Whatever's out there, they don't want to be found. And whoever goes looking for that fucking signal ends up dead. But it's the only chance we've got. And if anyone can get there alive, it's all of you. Shira, come on. Jakob! I that's in order. Sorry I left you to die in that med lab. Hey, no worries. Didn't really have a choice. <laughs> I'd have done the same. I'm not willing to write McCain off yet. He's one tough son of a bitch. I know you have a million questions, but I don't have time. You let me sleep in a few too many fucking years. I think you can find some time. How did it all begin? Why'd you start fighting? When the anomaly got bad, we had only just begun the colonization. There were still more than half a million frozen in cryo waiting for us to wake them. But we already knew we couldn't feed them all. So one faction argued to just pull the power and let them die in their sleep, preserve the resources we had. The others wanted to give them a chance to live. I can guess which side you were on. I was, I was wrong. We tried to be fair and to ration what we had, but it only led to bloodshed. Your enemy, what did they want? What do any of us want? To have enough, but there isn't. Enough food, enough water, anything. They won't settle until they have all we have. They want to destroy us. So I need to destroy them first. What am I now, altered? Help me understand. What do you want to know? How many are there? There are lesser ones all over with small and strange mutations. But those with true power, only a handful. Still more than I'm comfortable with. But the soldiers revere them as gods. The other altered out there, who do they fight for? Whoever the fuck they want, you think anyone controls them? The ones who fight with us, they at least seem to have a reason for it. Some shred of humanity still. But on the other side, they're demonic, wrathful gods, machines of death. There's nothing human left. That won't happen to me. 
I pray that's true. This is insane. I watched you take this photo a few hours ago. That was a lifetime ago. That girl you met that day is long gone. That girl could never have survived. Take it. I don't need it anymore. You've been gone too long to understand how truly fucked we are. There can be more than 50 or 60,000 of us left. More on the other side than ours. Soon there'll be none of us left to fight. The insurgents' last assault was a distraction. They were digging tunnels and planting charges right beneath us. They blew our front line all to hell. I noticed. The reports of casualties are uncountable. And one of my best men was out there, Lieutenant McCain. But a message just got through. And he's trapped under the rubble, still alive. I don't have any more men to spare. I need you to get him out. It's the least I can do. I want to hear the moment our search parties turn up anything about McCain. This McCain is still alive. I need to find him. Captain Reiner's dead. Yeah, good riddance. Other vendors are cleaning them up. <laughs> Suckers. If you see Gutman, tell her I ain't paying with God. What you see is what you get. Ain't nothing free. Altered or not.
How the hell does the ECA expect traders to make do without government subsidies? What you see is what you get. Come on in, sweetheart. Madame Beauvoir. Oh. No touching. <sighs> Beastie boys on by. <laughs> Even on Earth, these were hard to come by. How do you know about that? A long story. You a collector? Someone gotta be. Everyone else is all too ready to forget. How did, uh, all this get here? <laughs> well, when we left Earth. All we all got was one box of our things. Now people got no interest all the junk we brought. Not me. This... This our history. All we was... All we lost... My little... Museum of Earth. Always looking for donations. Ink? How? Like I said, long story. Thank you. Without memories of the past, the future means so little. If you come across anything else from old Earth, there's a home for it here. I'll keep an eye out. Remember to keep your eyes open for beautiful things to build my shells. Something words to rescue these artifacts. Hey, Shira. I got some business in Hound's territory. What can you tell me about their leader, this guy Barker? He fights dirty, preys on the innocent. His men are loyal because they're terrified of him. Would you let this guy run things inside your walls? He's too well fortified at the bottom of the rift. I'm fighting one damn war already. I can't afford another. Seems the house... The hound's hideout. Barker will be down here somewhere.
<laughs> Fuck off! You can't take her back! Who, the girl? This isn't a rescue, you Barker. Do I know you? Mr. Chang sends his regard. Oh, come on! It's right in the middle of my line. You are taking too long. I'm planning it all the way here. Thanks for the rescue, anyway. Again? Really wasn't here for you. Did you say... Mr. Chang is heal, right? Mm-mm. Fuckers! Like, it's not bad enough having insurgents trying to drag us all to hell. We gotta have these low-life gangsters on our streets picking us off from the inside. Yeah, I know the game. <clears throat> really hasn't changed a whole lot. Hey. You did a good thing. Got a bad guy off the street, and I'm walking home without a scratch. I'm Eva, by the way. Got a stall near Chang's place. You should all come see me there sometime. This is where it all happens. This garage, these grease stains and wrenches, this is Jakob Dabrowski's Sanctum Sanctorum. You're welcome. Why are you the only outrider alive? Do you think I was gonna explore this damn planet after what we saw? Fuck them. Let them have my badge. I didn't need to be an outrider that bad anyway. What happened to everyone else? None of the other outriders survived? Well, you had front row seats for the shit show that started it all. You know, most of us were dead that first day. The few dozen that were left, they did what we came here to do. They fucking explored. Wait. Right. Who do you think died trying to figure out we couldn't leave this fucking valley? Just think, if this mission gets me killed. Ain't no one. Good to see you again. You'll be pleased to know the hounds are still scared shitless. Well, well. I was hoping I'd see you around these parts again. Well, you just made a lousy day 2.5% better. Besides, with Mr. Chang gone, I still need a vendor. Well, anything you see, happy to give you a better discount.
getting the guy who killed poor Mr. Chang. 